Let's be honest, guys. We've all been irritated by a frustratingly long wait for a bus, which is due. <laughs> now, while you're waiting for that bus to arrive, your boss is, you know, he's mad at your lack of punctuality. So Be Live lets you know where and when the next bus is going to arrive, allowing you to make the decisions which really matter. Wait for that next bus or leg it and break a sweat. Now, although we were tasked with the increasing the reliability of public transport, we decided to shift our focus and focus more on the predictability of public transport. Now, yeah. Um, so we, the two key case studies that we drew most of our inspiration from were Geneva and Curitiba. Um, so Curitiba has one of the most low cost but highly used public transport systems in the world. Um, the bus rapid transit is basically a ring road of buses that are essentially bus only lanes, which means traffic in a city centre isn't really an issue. Um, also, it cut, buses run as frequently as every 90 seconds. Um, which cuts down passenger waiting times and encourages around 70% of Curitiba's commuters to take the bus to work. Um, Geneva uh, have buses, trolley buses and trams that go to virtually every area of the city, um, so it covers a, a great area. Um, and tickets can either be bought on the bus, on machines or <coughs> at the bus stop, so again it reduces passenger boarding times. Um, finally, one of our key research actually found that our perception of time is actually considerably greater when waiting for a bus than it is at any other time because we can't see where the bus is or we don't actually know how much longer we have to wait for a bus, um, which kind of increases irritability, which is a key insight that we really wanted to focus on. After this mountain of research, as well as many interviews we conducted, we decided there was more scope to improve the reliability of buses than other methods of public transport. Um, people tended to find they were late and unreliable and also that the um, timetables were confusing and inaccurate. So we wanted to address this in a way that was sort of interactive, so it really engaged our users, as well as um, intuitive and easy to understand. Uh, so we got together, we drew up some problem statements, um, and we decided our key three stakeholders, which were going to be businessmen and women, uh, foreign tourists, and students as well, because obviously that's the easiest group for us to empathize with. Um, we also love to get the lectures on time. Um, so for business men and women, um, single occupant cars uh, can be a, a huge cause of congestion, particularly during rush hour. Um, so enticing them to use the bus services by providing a reliable uh, and up-to-date schedule on when the buses are going to arrive um, should really encourage that and also reduce the traffic. Um, foreign tourists as well, they may not speak our language, they may be new to the city, um, and they also may be here on a uh, short break. Um, so they want to make the most of it and they also don't want to spend too much money. Um, so we think that our bus system, it's super easy to use. Uh, you can teach yourself to use it within, within minutes. Um, and so we hope that that will really answer the issues for all of us over the years. So inspired by Uber, BeLive is Bristol's first real-time bus tracking map and app. BeLive will compose of large visible screens at sheltered bus stops, showing buses which indicate the, ca the capacity of the bus by a gradient in red, from red to green. <laughs> green being very like empty, and red being quite full. And at first, we will decide to <laughs> we will decide to install them. <laughs> we'll install them within a couple of stops in Bristol, with uh, with hopes to expand to new cities and hopefully other countries. Uh, so for Be Live to Be Live, uh, we realise that um, further research and development must take place into the technologies that are required, such as the tracker on the buses, uh, the bus screens, and how they are linked together. Um, uh, however, we did uh, think, find that there are similar technologies such as uh, car uh, black boxes. We um, took confidence when we realised this. Um, uh, so with this gathered information, we will then take, um, take it to uh, city council or bus services running in Bristol for potential backing and funding. Uh, finally, we will continue to um, work on the user-friendly and intuitive nature of our service um, uh, with, alongside the users in testing uh, with the public uh, and we will uh, contact developers uh, for their services in making it tangible. Thank you very much.